For this question, we're told that the radius of the circle is 5 centimeters and line segment OC is 10 centimeters. What is the length of line segment AC? So if we're told that AC and BC are both tangents to this circle, then we can draw a line from the center point to the point of tangency and we know that that is going to be a right angle. So once we have a right angle triangle and we have the length of two of the sides, we can easily find the third side by using the Pythagorean theorem. So because the radius is five, we know that this length over here is going to be five centimeters because that's the radius. And we know that this length, oh, see, we're told that that's 10 centimeters. So that's the hypotenuse of the right angle triangle. So again, we can apply the Pythagorean theorem, a squared plus b squared equals c squared, and then just fill in our values. We know one of the legs, phi squared, but we don't know the other, so we'll just leave that as an unknown. And we know the long side. We know the, pi uh, the hypotenuse is 10 squared. So 5 squared is 25, plus b squared equals 10 times 10, which is 100. So subtracting 25 from both sides, we've got b squared equals 75. So if we know what b squared is, we can find the square root of that. And it's 8, rounded off to 8 decimal 6, 6. So line segment AC is equal to 8 decimal 6, 6 centimeters.